wouldn't be able to do this. Yeah. This hack with Yeah. I should go to the test because it's the same. Oh, look, this thing. Yeah. That's all right. Okay, it doesn't matter. We can always edit. So there's a set knox in here. So I just take off this, uh, this D loop. And now I can actually go like this and put the bolts. Oh, no, I can't. Okay, let's see here. So it goes once, up. Get the height that I want. Back to the way, Mike. And, just, no, and, and, and then, then back this way through the loop. And then there. And to the loop. And boom, bang. There we go. We got a proper D loop. It only took a few seconds to, seconds, to, yeah. to do. And now I'll make it quite tight. Because it is going to stretch a little bit. Not so it's going to stretch. So I'm going to. It would have been nice, Mike, if you had some wax. You could have waxed that and waxed with a set of those knots. Well, in this case, we're not uh, using so a we're peep. Gonna, we're we're just doing the peep eliminator, so we won't need well, wax. I, just, I think this should cut it. I'm not quite sure. Mm -hmm. He's not the players to do a nice job. Okay, here, what we're going to do is take George's knife here. My, my bench mate? Yeah. And then we'll tighten this baby up. That's pretty tight there. It should stretch out to no more than a quarter of an inch here. Uh, I could set this sure. set it and see sure. how... So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take this enough here just to, to fray it. I have a good fray here. That's quite a bit actually. And what I'm gonna do is burn that. So when you burn it, you gotta be careful not to burn your spring. So here we are, we're gonna light that up. And, and we're just gonna make a nice little flat, flat mark there. We'll let it dry for a second. And, it's, and then what we'll do, we'll pull that E loop through. And that's it. I'm back to shooting where I would have been stranded. And, and out of the game, I'm right back in it two seconds later. Here's your hand. Good. I'll take a mic. Thank you. So, uh, okay, now I cut this spring. What did I do with the spring? You threw it right there, Mike. Oh, here we I'll go. I'll throw this off now, Mike. Okay. Yeah. Okay. okay, so I'm going to put the string back in. It's all set to go. I'm just going to tighten it with my pliers. And... I get to have an enjoyable day with my friend George and out in the wild here, so it was just fantastic. Okay, Mike, I'm just going to turn it, I'm not going to turn it off until you do the final step. Okay, here. so now I'm going to do here, and I'm just going to stretch the deal as hard as I can. Just to make sure it's not going to fall, pull out, and... That's like a pull out at perfect D loop. Oh, there it is. You, know what, Mike, you, you don't have to worry about the, the peep twister not twisting because you do not have a peep on there. Yeah, so with the peep eliminator, we don't have to worry about setting it with the, the peep. You're right there, George. I'm usually right, Mike. <laughs> and so now uh, this is the conclusion of the, our peep. The, I had set knots in here and my D loop uh, frayed, so I had to cut it off and change it, but thank God I have my set knots where uh, all I have to do is tie above and bottom. There's my new uh, D loop after I finished tying it in the field at the Qualcomm uh, 3D uh, uh, range.